Hello Galaxy of Heroes, uh, recording this while I'm waiting for my opponent to respond in GAC and then I can give the result when I do the upload of that. Um, all my bits are ready, I've semi-edited, they'll be added all together and then I'll be uploading that after this, half hour, hour after this or so. Um, this is just me wanting to see that it wasn't a fluke the when I did the Luke Dewey and the three Hans. Um, so we've got OG Han, Stormtrooper Han and Captain Han. Of course anyone that went for Jedi Knight Luke has a Relic 3 Captain Han. Um, prior to the requirements dropping I already had a Relic 3 Captain Han with the Zeta as well. In fact, I've only one mod away from having a, a full health set on him just for what he does um, healing wise. So I must admit, I'm, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of most of the hands. Um, which harm? I suppose ranking first to last. OG Han's got to be there at first just because he is an absolute beast. Um, second Han, probably Stormtrooper Han, because of what he brings in, in a squad like this, because he's feeding team turn meter and everything. Each time he takes a hit, there's all sorts of wonderful things, and he's also got a pretty decent lead himself. Um, third, for me, would be Captain Han. Fourth, I'm trying to think of who the fifth Han is now. Fourth e would be. Um, I'm going to reach for me. Unless I've mentioned too many Hans and I can't count. Fourth would be the vet, because he is just a beast. Oh, damn, I just realised that I haven't even played my alt gack. Oh no, and I could win. Right, I need to get on that really quick. Um, <laughs> Who's the last? Wow. Yeah, anyway, th they all work really well. Han Solo. Stormtrooper Han. I don't know. I don't know. I've lost count somewhere. That's weird. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm just kind of lost. Um, wanted to see and um, whether or not you can just, you know, start using him here if you've got him. So I don't know how much of the Zeta plays a part here. Um, he does have the Zeta, of course, um, and the Zeta gives him um, the Zeta that gives the healing. Yeah, it, <clears throat> it gives a certain amount of percentage of his health, and my cold heart is one of my healthier to tunes. I mean, don't get me wrong; there are a lot of tunes that are far more healthier than he. Um, however. Um, he is pretty healthy, so yay. Um, and I've lost my train of thought because I'm trying to multitask and I can't multitask. Apologies. These lot are annoying. I've found just stunning, stunning the taunter and then just pick them all off. I mean, the thing is, is this is the tier two tier. Um, the top tier, as it were, so to speak. Well, not as it were, it is. Um, so they do take quite a lot of hitting. Even with... Uh, so, relic-wise, CLS is Relic 4. He has two Zetas. He doesn't have the Tenacity Zeta. Um, Captain Han, already discussed, Relic 4, does have his Zeta. 
Um, Stormtrooper Han is Relic 7. He has his Zeta, but his Zeta is on the lead, so I don't think it really applies here. And then OG Han um, has his... Does he have one or two? I can't remember how many he has, but however many he has, he has them. And he is Relic 7. I believe he only has one. Shoot first, actually, thinking about it. Um, and Chewie is also Relic 7 and has both Zetas. So, yes. But look, I mean... Our tank is still has a slither of protection and we're about to go into the final round. Um, so this time round, the idea was, or the hope was, that I actually survive with everyone intact. Part one of this plan has just been accomplished because Stormtrooper Han has now taunted, which means that Thrawn has to fracture him as long as he stays alive. Um, so now we're just switching around. I think that was a bit of a waste there, actually, because he could have done it himself, but never mind. It's done. Clear that. Palps kills himself. And now we can just get rid of Thrawn because Royal Guards, although they're quite annoying and they do get a few stuns out, um, aren't really going to trouble us that much, especially as we're whittling them down. So, in answer to the question, was it a fluke? No, it wasn't. Here's another round of doing it. And this time I improved by actually having everyone still standing at the end which is like yay so so good feeling i know it's silly and it's just a uh, an event or an assault battle or whatever but you know you take your victories in this game wherever you find them and this one was just nice to use a slightly different comp and still romp on through so that's all of it thank you for watching